Welcome back to Amiibo Doctor. Today we're going to see LML123's Banjo-Kazooie Amiibo versus Spike's Byleth. Now I should, we've already seen the Banjo Amiibo in the uh, Joker versus Banjo Amiibo fight. Um, if that video's not up yet, well that sucks for you. However, <laughs> um, this Byleth is very interesting to me. So it's been theory crafted out already that the optimal Byleth has got to be side B spam, right? It's a massive wall. It hits the tipper pretty much perfectly every single time. It's a frankly incredible way for an amiibo to use a move. This amiibo doesn't do that. This Byleth has a very unique play style. By the way, that up special thing right there, that's built in. It could do that. Yeah, yeah. We're kind of expecting Byleth to be like A plus or S tier. Honestly, I, I don't even know where this one is gonna go. Like it's so great and, and but you could also do so many things with it. This amiibo is gonna blow everyone's mind. Um, Banjo, we're expecting BB plus. So I'm anticipating that Byleth is gonna win. Um, I was anticipating that long before. But uh, this, this is already a really good banjo. We saw it in the fight. Um, this, this is a very fun banjo to fight as well. Uh, with LML's permission, I might convert him into a raid boss, actually. <laughs> with Spike, however, with his Byleth, um, his Byleth is much more focused on the slow and steady. Now, if you watch... Well, okay, I guess not. I was expecting that it was going to, you know, take a little bit of its time instead of getting thrown off the edge. That's fine. This Byleth mostly takes its time. Um, it doesn't usually rush into things, but it seems to be doing that a lot, this match back throw. Yep, there you go. It likes to back throw at the ledge. And that is almost like a, a yin and yang against Banjo, because Banjo, especially this one, is almost a rushdown. You know what I mean? So I'm, I'm especially intrigued to see how these two go. Obviously, Byleth is going to win, but that's fine. Who cares? Oh, by the way, before this gets uh, into the heat of battle, um, be sure to like this video because, come on, it's Byleth and Banjo fighting like before they come out. Why wouldn't you want to watch more of this? Good lord, people. There you go. Byleth has one counter, and that's dying. Oh, my god, I didn't... What? <laughs> she just speared him. Just, I didn't think that was... I So I was estimating, so I was like trying to think out the video ahead of time. And I was like, okay, we probably got about 20 more seconds of this. And then we're going to go into the next match. And then we're going to, you know, it was like, bam, I'm going to spear you. Like, good lord, child. Like, you just... Smokey the Bear would be very cranky at you right now. Very cranky. By the way, if somebody can explain these names here, like, because I, I, don't, I don't know what a Gyro Midna is or an Ash... Spelled like, I mean, it's not a Pokemon reference because it's got an E. Okay, so that's one of the weird things about Byleth that you just saw. That down air right there, sometimes it spikes, sometimes it doesn't. It's really unusual. Usually kills either way, but still, that was, that was odd. I, I do find it interesting how Spike trained this Byleth to be basically the opposite of what we were theory crafting the, uh, the optimal Byleth to be. Interesting design choice. I, I look at Amiibo the same way I look at architecture. You're trying to make a functional building. You know, you can either do what people do or you can do the opposite, right? But it's still got to be a functional building, you know? Yo, the down... Okay, so Byleth Down Smash is actually one of the most broken moves in Amiibo because they almost never see it coming. It's got super armor, kills pretty frequently. So for Banjo to tank that with... Was that super armor or invincibility? I'm, I'm actually not sure. Uh, but for Banjo to be able to tank that is like... He's trying to spear him again. Bear kebab. That is an amazing recovery that Byleth has. Like, just, just looking at the... Oh, hello. Just looking at the angle of the thing, like, you would think it would only go vertical, but the Amiibo tends to go all the way out and still recover. There you go. Side B edge guard. Yo! That's one of the ways that side B is going to be one of the most broken moves. I'm going to fight this Amiibo next. It's going to be really fun. Um, that's one of the ways that Byleth is going to be one of the most 
broken moves, okay? Because that side B, not only does it hit below the ledge, you can't even see my hand, not only does it hit below the ledge, but it also comes up and over. It's a full, complete ledge guard. Like, it's insane. So if you're going to beat the Byleth Amiibo, this one is not as wally as most of them. So we're going to have to get a little creative. I think we're going to go... I haven't played Hero in months, so this ought to be interesting. Um, it's either Hero or Me Gunner uh, are the characters that you should use to beat Byleth. You can use others, um, but projectiles are really what you're going to want. Oh, dear. For the record, uh, these Amiibo are vanilla. They have no spirits. Ha! I outrange you. How does it feel? How does it feel to be pathetic? Pathetic, Byleth. No, I wanted that to connect. That would have been so funny. I don't know what I did. And I don't know how that killed. Life is interesting. Ooh. I don't have zoom! Ah! took a risk. I was really hoping I'd have zoom and then I'd not have to worry about getting edge guarded. Platforms are your friend when fighting an amiibo because oftentimes they won't tech properly necessarily and so you can get in under them. There's my zoom on stage. Gee, thanks. Watch this. Mm, there it goes. So Sephiroth's neutral special and uh, Hero's fully charged side special are two moves that are like that. They're multi-hits, they're massive KO potential, big damage, um, easy to use, great for, you know, they're all great for ledge guarding, right? Great for kills, great for ledge guarding, if you can connect them. That's the hard part. I was really hoping it would be a bigger one than that. Well... That was straightforward. I hate to end this video here, but I beat it on the first try. So, I, okay. Uh, thanks for watching and go to AmiiboDoctor.com and like and subscribe. I don't know. That was fast, wow.